My career before I joined LVS was relatively short. I was 22 when I arrived uh, at the school and I'd done one year of work before, uh, between u leaving university and, uh, and starting business school, which was for my family company. So I sort of thought, well, do I really want to work for my father for the next uh, n years? And I decided I didn't. And business school was a good place to go after that. When I think back to uh, the, uh, the impact the MBAs had on me, I mean, it was, it was really transformational. I, was faced, I, was, I knew I was going to go into business in some form. And the more traditional method in those days was to become an accountant. And given the choice between three years of accountancy work and you know, two years of MBA with holidays, you know, which were quite long, uh, it was really a very easy decision. And uh, it, uh, it really transformed my own career and, and gave me uh, you know, quite a large number of opportunities that I probably wouldn't otherwise have had. Since I left LBS, uh, obviously when I was doing the milk round, I applied for a number of different jobs. And somehow or other, all the banks I applied to offered me jobs and nobody else did. So I, I realized there was a message in that somewhere. And I joined uh, an investment bank, uh, which was called Hill Samuel. And I was there for a few years. And then I was uh, asked to join Goldman Sachs and did some fascinating work uh, with them. Uh, and um, one of uh, my most interesting early jobs was floating a company called Vodafone. Uh, which is where I first got to know my, uh, my current uh, employer. And then I moved from Goldman Sachs after a number of years to, to UBS. And I retained a relationship uh, with Vodafone and ended up working on the largest uh, uh, M&A deal in history, which was Vodafone's acquisition of, of Mannersman, which is still the largest uh, M&A deal um, ever done. Then, as a result of, of, of working quite closely with Vodafone, uh, the, the previous chief executive, who I got to know quite well, sort of rang me up at the end of 2005 and, and asked me to join the, the group executive committee. So, whilst uh, many companies were outsourcing uh, various functions, I was uh, insourced. My current job is group strategy and business development director at Vodafone. It's a fascinating time for the mobile communications industry because over the last uh, 20 years, if you like, there's been this explosion in people using mobile phones to talk to each other. So you could call it an explosion of voice. Um, over the next 20 years, we're going to see an explosion of data. So people are going to be using uh, these internet uh, access devices, and voice will simply be one application uh, of many applications which you're seeing on iPhones, you're seeing on Google phones, you're seeing on all sorts of smartphones which means that the amount of data carried over the, the mobile networks will go up by, who knows, 100 times or something like that over the next 10 years or so. And therefore, this will transform the way not only customers and people use their phones, but it will also transform our business. Because rather than carrying voice, we'll be carrying uh, you know, thousands and thousands and millions of, of bytes of data, and that'll be what we, that'll be what we do. It'll transform the way we price our services. It'll transform the way we build our networks. Uh, it'll transform the way we compete uh, and, and cooperate with, with different players in the industry. So it's a very profound uh, change that we're dealing with. I'm tremendously proud of being an LBS uh, alum, uh, it, not just because of the opportunities it's given me, but because of the opportunities it can continue to give uh, lots of other people which is one of the reasons I, I continue to support uh, the school in a, in, you know, in a number of ways. And uh, you know, I was delighted to see the school voted as the best business school in the world by, uh, by the FT uh, survey. I thought that was a fantastic achievement and a, and a great tribute to the work that's been done you know, over the last 30 years or so since I, I'm, I left.